Peace family, it's your brother Jay Speaks. And today I want to talk about an article I've seen on the news pertaining to schools not talking about race and slavery because they want America to be seen as this great quote-unquote nation. Now this, um, I think this started in Tennessee. They're proposing bills to stop schools from speaking on history and what really happened to black people in America. And for one, I'm not surprised. I mean, we went from slavery being talked about, you know, for a quote unquote chapter or a unit in the history book to get one page and then they go straight to Martin Luther King. These people have been trying their best to get rid of their terrible th deeds throughout America's history. And for one part, they are succeeding because a lot of our children don't know anything about slavery they think it was indentured servitude and that we were just working for people and they were quote unquote paying us and brought us here and we've been just been living here and everything's been cool. But in reality, these people committed some of the worst crimes in mankind to black people and still do. But you cannot expect your 400 year old enemy to all of a sudden just stop being your enemy. These people have been doing things to us nonstop, and they haven't let up. They have been constantly down our throats about how, they, how much they hate us, how much they don't want us here, and they constantly show it. It's on us right now. We are the ones that are constantly waiting out hope for them to finally have some type of sympathy for us and do things for us that we could do for ourselves. Like, how long are we going to let these people continue and continue to deceive us and lie to us and say whatever they want to say? There's no reason in the world that we should have to continue to rely on them to just be better and do right by us. Now, a lot of people won't agree with this, but at the end of the day, the only solution to things like this is teaching our own children, having our own schools. Yeah, we don't want to go back to quote unquote segregation, but we need some type of separation. There's no reason in the world why we should be integrated in schools where they don't teach our history or what they've done to us. They ignore it and act like it never happened, but we literally built this country through our blood, sweat, and tears. This is really our country at the end of the day. The America's only as good as it is because it's made its money and everything off of free labor, 100% free labor. So there's no, we should not be dependent on them to teach our children thinking that they are going to do right by us and tell the truth because they are proving that they have no obligation, they don't feel like they should, and they just flat out don't want to. They want to continue to hide everything that they've done and make America seem like this is such a quote-unquote great country. And everybody should be happy to be here. Our best and only solution is homeschooling our children or having schools of our own that 100 percent teach the truth of what is done to us and what is what was done and what continues to be done to us and how we can overcome and us before we even got here. They love to talk about us being slaves and the civil rights movement and stuff like that. But what about our true history and the, the kings and queens and guys that we were before we even got here? They will never shed light on that. But they'll talk about Christopher Columbus, George Washington, Abraham Lincoln, all these other quote unquote white scholars all day. All these white people that have done so much and our children are there eating that up every single day of school. So when they leave school, they feel like they have never accomplished anything in history. And white children leave school feeling like they accomplish everything. So we have to have our own systems and our own schools so that we can teach and elevate our children. Because they are continuing to continue to erase our history from every history book that they have. They do not want slavery brought up. They don't want it mentioned. They don't want to see it. They don't want to hear about it. It's just gone. They only want to teach what they have done for them. They don't want to teach how they treated us and how they continue to treat us. They want to sweep all that stuff under the rug. And then we get to thinking, oh, America is this 
great country and there's no more racism and all this extra mess that we just, for some reason, can't get away from. So, yeah, our best and only solution is to provide and teach ourselves. You cannot expect your enemy to teach you right if he won't even treat you right. But that's all I have for y'all, family. Let me know if y'all like the video. Please like, comment, and subscribe. Appreciate y'all. I'm out.